you need strength against manipulation. The world is full of manipulation. And that's why I'll be preaching on the subject. Strength against the dead. We'll be taking a journey to the realm of the spirit. It is what you know that you can conquer. He said in that verse 7 of Numbers chapter 9, he said, Those men said unto him, We are defied by the dead. So the Father, we are defied by the dead. We couldn't gather with our mates. I have seen a Christian that went to celebrate 10 years remembrance. She said because he saw a late mother in the dream. And the late mother was saying to her, go and do 10 years remembrance for me. And carried everything. She went to the village to do the 10 years remembrance of her mother. After some time, Asep died. Conceal of the sickness she came with from the village. And she was airbent about the fact that she had, she saw the mother. And she developed that sickness and she yielded the ghost. If the devil has deceived her into, into premature death, so the enemies use the dead to defile a man. I'm sure you know it is written. It is given to a man to die once and after death there is judgment. So how come the dead are the one talking to you always in your dream? It is a manipulation from the pit of hell. And that's why in the book of Numbers chapter 16 from 48 the Bible says and he stood between the dead and the living. And the plague was still. The prophet stood between the dead and the... To drive the dead back. So you need power to drive those manipulations. Am I saying that the image of your late mother have been deleted from your uh, subconsciousness? No! But when it's becoming manipulative in the dream, then you should know. You should receive strength to fight it. The only time Jesus saw the dead, they came to tell him that he would die. Luke 19. I mean Luke chapter 9 rather. Verse 30. That was the only time. Stop yielding to all these manipulations of the devil. 1 Samuel 28. Saul went to the wish of Adam to consult. So the woman brought up a dead person. But when that dead person was coming, he said, I saw God, Osha, coming from the dust. But he put on an image of an old man. And Saul said, that image is Samuel. The image I'm seeing now is like image of Samuel. So may use image of the person that know that can assess you. They know that if you should see the image of your late mother, you will be convinced. In the book of Ecclesiastes chapter 9, I will be reading from verse 5. It said for the living, know that they shall die, but the dead know not anything. So your mother that is buried does not know anything. She is waiting for the day of judgment. She has nothing to do on earth anymore. He said neither, neither are there any more reward. So there is nothing in her hand that she can give to you. For the memory of them is forgotten. Verse 6. Also their love. Oh, Abi Yamani, or to Yosimilo Jonu, or to Fernand Mibochepe. No, the Bible said their love had buried with them. Their hatred, I 
and they are healthy. It's not perish. The Bible says, and neither do they have anything, any portion in things that are done up there. The sun, just the dead, visit the head. No, Luke 16 27 to 31. The rich man was begging for the Abraham. Where the rich man was, he was in agony. He didn't want his brothers to come there. He said, Father Abraham, okay, if you can't give me water, help me send somebody from here. They will believe him. Somebody they know before. But Father Abraham told the rich man, he said, no. He said, from this place, we do not send the dead. They have the prophet with them. If they do not listen to those prophets, it means they won't listen to anybody. Heaven does not send the dead to convey any message. So how come you keep saying the dead one? Second Corinthians eleven fourteen, and marvel not, for Satan himself is transformed into an angel of light. Marvel not, marvel not, and that is why in Matthew 22, verse 32, God said, I am the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob. God is not the God of the dead, but the Lord God of the living. Hallelujah. So he does not say the dead on an errand, it is the devil that you see the image of the dead. Hear the word of God. Every appearance of the dead is destroyed. Amen. 